You have to try these tips the next time you stay at a hotel from a flight attendant. Starting out, if you don't have a dishwasher in your hotel room, I would never use the glass cups. The reason being is you don't know if they're cleaned properly or they're just rinsed out from the last people who stayed in that hotel room. If you have a cup that is fully sealed, then you know they're good to use. If your hotel doesn't offer breakfast in the morning, what you can do is heat up water in your coffee maker, bring one of those instant oatmeal packets and just pour it in your cup. All you have to do is pour the hot water in and you have instant oatmeal for morning. These remotes are seeing so many hands with how many people are staying in the hotel room and you have no clue if they're being sanitized. Grab an ice bag and wrap your remote in it. Follow me on Instagram for more tips. If you do this one simple thing on an aircraft, I promise you, you will get royal treatment from the flight attendants. Being a flight attendant is exhausting. You're always in different time zones, waking up crazy hours and dealing with angry customers. So I promise you, the next time you fly, if you want special treatment from the flight attendants, this is all you have to do. $5 Starbucks gift cards. It means the world to us when a customer gives us this. And if you don't have gift cards, you can just pick up some candy bars, lip balm, anything, and give them to your flight attendants. We will know where you're sitting and we will know what you look like and the whole crew will make sure you are taken care of. If you are traveling, please, please, please do not make these travel mistakes from a flight attendant. If you see someone put their nasty foot right here where you're sitting. I am giving you permission to freaking, <clears throat> just kidding, don't do that. But like, tell them to get their foot off, it's gross. Second, don't walk around the airplane without your shoes. Oh, it's so gross. I understand sitting and taking it off still, that's a little, uh, but like walking around the airplane, guys, don't do it, don't do it. Dead serious, this happened to me on a flight. I had someone clipping their fingernails and it was like, bing, bing. Don't do personal hygiene on the aircraft. Oh, it's so bad. And then on top of it, painting your fingernails, awful. And lastly, please, you guys, please take a shower before you get on the plane. There's nothing worse than sitting in a seat and you're sitting next to someone who has BO. It's, it's awful.